Hey, it's Dan. I'm live right now, uh, Saturday, in beautiful, beautiful Oak Lawn, Illinois. Just want to get a little thought out to you, something that's been rattling around in my head for a few moments here. Um, sometimes we see people kind of take a stand and, and very publicly, very forcefully express thoughts which uh, essentially agree with the prevailing opinion of those with great influence and power in the culture. They're in agreement with, with the people in power. And oddly, sometimes this is identified as great courage. And um, yeah, it's sort of like agreeing with the cool kids back in high school. <laughs> that doesn't take any courage. That's not courageous. Courage happens when a person expresses thoughts which disagree with the prevailing opinion of those with great influence and power in the culture. It's disagreeing with those folks. That's the courage. Now, the person expressing these contrarian thoughts, that person might be wrong. Could be wrong. That's a separate debate. The point I'm getting at right now is that the person who's actually willing to stand against, stand against the cultural current, the one, uh, put it this way, the one who disagrees with the cool kids. <laughs> That's the one who is courageous. That's the one whose uh, who's lunch money is at great risk. <laughs> that's, that's, that's the one who may soon be taking a trip to Wedgieville. <laughs> uh, you know, when Jesus spoke against the power brokers, of, of the culture in which he lived. When he spoke against, and that's exactly what he did, that was courage. Judas wasn't courageous. Peter, God bless him, but Peter wasn't courageous. At least not in that moment when, when Jesus was on trial. He wasn't courageous then. What Jesus did, that was, that was courage, real courage. You know, being courageous can be scary, quite frankly. Matter of fact, in some circumstances, being courageous could even literally be dangerous. It could be something very... Again, this is sort of the nature of, of the real definition of courage. But real courage, real courage, my friends, that is an admirable character quality. We could use a little bit more real courage from folks these days.